All right. What's up, guys? And welcome to Wi-Fi Bell with the Camera Week. And uh, well, you know, it's been a roughly one week break because I, well, got myself a bit of COVID and never really recovered. So I'm kind of glad to be back at this. Though, excuse me if I force myself to be worth the coffin. Um, yeah, facing off against OU in its finest, and uh, that should be that should be great. Let's see what it takes us. Plus, it's a you know what standard smoke on OU, so um, it might just as well break me early and recover from there. Max quick, yeah, that's that's not even close. Was what I was thinking. So initially, I I assume my opponent was thinking a fortress lead, which is fine. Um. Okay, Volt switch on this. And... Um, do my opponent go for Stealth Rocks? That's the question. We just love a plume, right? Like, everything is fine and fair game. That's a fat one. <laughs> That's a really fat one. Alright. So, best switching for me. I think Mordor makes most sense. I for life of me can't like remember. Like I had Guard Chomp, he has like a Sam, Fair Alligator, Stealth Rocks. Yeah, makes sense. I think Specs or Power has no downplay to it, and I do believe I forced my opponent out quite right. I just I can't remember if it had a floater. Let's see, goes for a power as fair. With solid rock it shouldn't take me out. So uh, I'm I'm totally fine with that, and that should be heat run out. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Though it should be said, um, not sure camera can do anything more for this game. Ah, lemon juice. Everything to. Do not die. Let's see. Full Zend. Alright, this is awful. Um, free Dragon Eyes on this side. Um, yeah. I'm... I think that's greedy. Maybe. Let's see what power will do. Ooh. Wow. Okay. It would have been nice if I had any mon here with could. Um, actually, I kind of do. Is he crunch? Yeah, nothing to it. I mean, as long as he doesn't have awkward yet, I don't believe that's a problem. How about that? Never thought I'd say it, but I kind of like this. Don't have awkward yet. I don't want to see the torrent awkward yet. I don't want to see it. Camera did things though. I am super happy with that. But yeah, like guard chump is a solid switch in. Yeah, decided against it. I get that. I mean, it's a hard decision to make for sure. And um, all things consider. What would be my best switching? Aghanim is quite a right. And I get my Toxic Orb activated. Um, I do think Scissor kind of comes into this. Let's find out, right? If Elika Sam comes in, then I'm in trouble. Whiskers. Yeah. How about that? Um. Alright. Hoping for a psychic. Hoping to stomach a psychic. That might actually be the right word to use. Focus Blast would suck, but there's no way he's making that play. Yeah, Psychic. Not very effective, I wonder. Can't help feeling it kinda, kinda hurt anyway. Not sure I can take another one. 
And if there's Shadow Ball, that should be probably easier for him to make. But yeah. I can't... Um, I'm overreaching if I do anything but... But this should invite the guard jump. Or the scissor. Champita. I'll say. Roughest skin in the game. Yeah, that's not great. But Aghanim can come back. And I should be able to... Um, well, honestly, stay in. Outrage sure will do something, but... I'm thinking more Scissor to this. And if Alakazam comes in, then I'll clearly... Um, Probably try to hurt it. Soul stance, yeah, that's aggressive. That's up there. Come on, Ice Fang, right? Yes! No, did nothing. <laughs> At least we know we dragon dances, right? Or not dragon dance, I mean. Um, then I got the Umbreon, which definitely stings. Yeah, we're second Enclave. That's what we do. I mean, I am in a recovery game, I feel. Um, Jeez. Fort Ridley. Life Orb 2, that's kind of cool. Um... Sunny and Wilfred. I think close combat is fine. I think it is. Because I really can't beat Alaka Sam anyway. I could hope for him. That it brings it on next time and just try to hurt it. Oh, we switch this out. Fair enough. Goes into Luigi. All right. Let's see, close combat will do. That's a two-hit kill. That's gonna work. That works. Not looking forward for the bullet punch though. Right, bring in Millionaire. I don't know how much we can take. There is no way he U-turns though. Or maybe. Nope. At least we got it right. Ah, it still hurts, I wonder. Right, fire punch here. Hoping he stays in. Ah, no, why would you? To Chompita, who's. Let's see. Nope, 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 nope. I can't reposition myself either, so. Only thing I kind of like is it doesn't necessarily enjoy um, my primate, but it just the second place aren't there. Switches out again, that's fine. Go to Asula. All right.
we'll switch on this. I'm pretty sure we're looking at a U-turn or um, we could look at a wish play. I think. I get him. You're up. Let's see. Far play. How aggressive want to go about this? I want a soul stance. Just decide to stay in. So I'm kinda scared of that. Um, foul play? Wishes. Fair enough. I don't know how much a foul play will do this time, but there's always a risk with um, like foul play Umbreon. But basically, I, I need to stay aggressive even though I don't enjoy it one bit. Ah, not even close. And this foul play was close to kill me. Yep. And I'll just keep attacking. I mean, I could, in theory, recover stall through his fall place. Of that I'm sure. I don't lose anything by recovering, but at the same time we are in a stalemate where I end up losing anyway, so do I want to pressure that? I gotta ask myself that. Because he knows I got him in a potential lockdown, but at the same time he can just reposition himself and he should be fine. Yeah, I'm not going to do that forever. Though he's probably thinking I would. And which Pokemon makes most sense, if so, to bring in. Come on, switch out. Damn it. Crit? Crit would have been nice. Dear God. Well, we lose. Sadly, we lose. But at the same time, we got some hard-ass OU here. So I'm kind of glad Camera did some stuff. But, uh, yeah. Let's see how much Wilfred can do before he falls, then. I mean, that that's the end game, right? At least Wilfred can come back and forth for a few times. There's no way he sacks Umbre on here. I'd rather see Garchomp fall. Or he goes for Protect. Of course he has Protect. Come on, buddy. Come on. You're not for switching in your... Your Alakazam. I think it's too hit killed by this. Or I'm pretty sure it is. There we go. Solid. But yeah, I am thinking there is, there is no way I'm beating because Luigi and I should be in bullet punch range. So with that in mind, I'm absolutely at, like sacking here. Let's wrap it up. Um, that's it guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this game anyway. I know it's what I've been on the shorter side and I don't need I don't want the games to be this short, but sometimes, or not, not a short side, but a one-sided side, I mean. But sometimes you just get these opponents that are way in there, and my teams are definitely not the side with that in mind. Now, had I had a Stallbreaker variant of, um, um, let's say, um, um, what do you call it, um, Gliscor, I maybe could have pushed this game to something different, but... It just wasn't there. It just wasn't there, and it's fine. Um, 
I wonder why it takes so long though, like, he basically switched into like a salmon, that's a wrap. Right, that, that should be the play. You, you sack Scissor. <coughs> and you wrap up the game. That you can't, you can't beat it slow when you have offensive momentum with a defensive team, come on. God, what is it doing? <laughs> Taking a dump ball by them? There is no way he's like. Like, come on, wrap it up already. There we go, nice. So, guys, hope you enjoyed this game, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, take care, one, alright?